Yes, you're seeing this right. Halloween came a little early for Kaisertown. These kids dressing up for beggars night, a South Buffalo tradition that lets trick or treaters get their hands on some candy a day early. It's just the heart of Kaisertown. Everybody's so nice around here, you know, growing up over here, you get to know everybody and you know, it's just a good experience. Haley Whalen has been coming to Beggar's Night since she was six years old. Now she gets to watch kids from all over Western New York come to join the tradition. My Theo lives around here and then I just wanted to visit and then I came trigger treating here. I come here every year because my dad's friend always throws a party over there so my dad likes to go and we always just come around trick or treat. But this is probably one of the coldest times I've ever been trick or treating. Yeah. It's so cold. But as the sun set, the chilly temperatures didn't stop the fun. While Beggar's Night is the perfect practice for saying trick or treat, it's also the perfect way to start practicing your Halloween safety. I met Dennis Herlin, who sells glow sticks to kids. His motto be safe, be seen. I do this like yearly just to keep the kids safe, you know. Give them some toys that light up, plus the kids are happy and they're safe. The National Safety Council recommends having an adult present at all times with young children. I have a pep talk with her before, you know, we go out. I mean, we use the whole stranger danger rule. And checking your kids' candy before it's eaten. I check to make sure that there's no holes, anything ripped, stuff like that, because, you know, it happens. It could be anybody. But, of course, don't forget to have fun. Hannah Ferreira, 7 News, Buffalo.